to Christchurch International Cup. We're out here in Yoldhurst at the Christchurch Football Centre for the under-14s final. The Fencibles from Auckland taking on Red Sox Manawatu. It's been a great few days here in Christchurch. has really put on the weather. I think if you look back to this time last year, we were playing around in about a foot of water. But it is blue skies and a balmy 14 degrees. No wind. Having a look at these two sides. Well, they both came from the same pool. The Fencibles lost one game, 1-2, one and lost to Nomads before going on to beat Christchurch United 1-0 in the quarters. And then dispatching Cashmere Technical 4-1 in the semis. And for the Red Sox, well, they lost to the Fencibles in the pool plate before going on to win 2-0 over Otamata in the quarters and then beating FC Nelson 2-0 in the semi. Looking at the lineups for today for the Fencibles, Johnson, Chineka, Sakura, Hamilton, Singh, Nguyen, Number, Rantawa, Bovong, Kate, Chong, Holder, and Matopi for the Red Stocks. It's Costello, Kid, Moriyama, Kudurangi, Simmons, Pearson, Goga, Whitney, Barker, Rose, Chawanji, Easton, Barnett, Robinson, Blackley, and Jones. Now, there has been a slight kit change before kickoff today. It's a bit of a mix up between which side was the home side. So I think the Fencibles will be coming out in their blue kit and unfortunately won't have any numbers on their back. Which will make it slightly hard for me to call. But I'll do my best as we progress through the day. The coaches for Red Sox, Caleb Young and Cole Freeman, they were pretty happy with the response after the loss to the Fencibles. And to quote them both, it has been good. And Caleb Young also wanted me to point out that he has played two games on the turfs here at Christchurch. One goal and one red card. So a good outing and maybe a not so good one. Of course as well, these two sides, Red Sox Massey Academy, established in 2022 for the Fencibles from Pakaranga in Auckland. Been around for a while now. As we can see, the team's getting ready here. It's been a great tournament so far here, if you are watching. Plenty of different age brackets. Start with the under-15s tomorrow morning as well. And then in the second week, under-13s, which is quite a big competition. Great facilities out here in the Oldhurst. You can see the turf in front of you on the screen. There's one behind as well, as well as the new five-a-side pictures out to the top right of the screen. 25 minutes each way, and there will be straight penalties if scores are level at the end of the game. An interesting match, obviously a strong pool that both of these sides came from. Did just see Nomads beating Dunedin City Royals in a previous game. Plate final, possibly. Just have the two teams here getting themselves ready. Referees as well, lined up, ready to go before the formalities. Of course, if you are in the area over the next few weeks, action on here every day of the week for the next few weeks. There's an interesting matchup tomorrow morning. Sydney FC travelling over from Australia. I'll be taking on the Christchurch United home side. That one kicks off at 9.30. If you are in the area and keen to see some action, worth heading on down here to Yaldhurst. Still just waiting on the fencibles here. Possibly 
a late arrival of their reserve kit, but they look like they are going to line up in the blue. As the referees are doing their final checks before we walk out onto the field. As that sun begins to hide away here, the temperature definitely cooling off. A good crowd in here as well. Lots of supporters making the trip down from Palmy and Auckland to be here. And he's talking to the Red Sox as well before this. Finished 13th last year in this tournament. So for them to make it through to the final here. They're pretty happy with that outcome. They'll also give me a couple of facts here to share on the stream. Unfortunately, I think Cooper Jones for the Red Sox broke his arm. It was the Golden Gloves last year, so won't be seeing them out on the field today. There's the two captains come forward. No real advantage in the wind. Really settled off. Slight breeze, I guess, blowing left to right on the screen, but probably can't imagine it'll play too much into the game. It'll just be that low sun. As you can see on the goal to your left. Definitely need a hat down there if you are goalkeeping. Looks like the Red Sox are setting up to play with the sun behind them. And looks like Captain Rose there did get the win and we'll stay as we are. So, look all set to go here. So we can see the setup. Holder, the captain for Fencibles, playing at centre back, supported by Singh. And Matopi. So, fence balls to get us underway here. Referees have done their checks. 25 minutes each way. Playing in the blue. There's the fence ball set this one forward here. There's a good touch there from Kururangi. Just sends that one away. And we start to slow it down in midfield here. Matopi goes short here, good step inside, still going now is Chong. As he tries to send this one through, chance to shoot here, we have to centre, does chips back post, falls nicely here, can it sit up? Good block there by the Red Sox and they'll come again. As they drop it back here to Matopi, centres. This is great movement already from the fencibles. These guys under 14s. Using the space of the pitch as this one's sent forward now. Bit of room. Coming across is Kururangi. Just holds him up. Drops it back. Trying to find a way through. Here we go, the Red Sox now. As they try to send that one forward, but will be out of the field on the far side. Throw in now for the fencibles. Easy to confuse here. Pretty much similar colours in the badge. So it is the Red Sox playing more so in their home kit. There's Holder on the ball now. Time for him as they step forward. Good channels in that midfield. They have defensibles as this one sent forward now. Coming across is Simmons. Gets round one, still going now. Can he get the shot away? Numbers forward, shot blocked there by Kudurangi, still here for the fencibles as they chip forward, chance, great little chip finish, and it's in! Oh, what a finish there from the fencibles inside the first two minutes, just a little dink over the top, and they weren't able to clear their lines, what a finish that was. Great little chip forward as well. On, 
trying to take names from the fans on the sideline. I think it was Lucas Bovong who chipped that one forward. But the Red Sox, how can they answer? Send this one forward. Falls now for Baker. Still going as Baker. And he can't get through the top eight. As he just sends that one out on this near side. They'll resettle on defence. Will the fencibles. Jeez, what a goal. Get this final started. Still early days though. As Holder sends that one away. The room to move again. Two men on him. No. It's just forced out of field. A bit more settled at the moment. Defensibles. But a foul throw calling there by the referee. So he lifted his foot there. It's probably below your camera. There's one there from the fencibles. Just look a bit hungrier at the moment. Apologies. As it will be Blackley. Get this one in. We just need to build a bit of possession here to the Red Sox. Far side now for Chiwanji. Trying to step around. Will be out of field. It's that early goal always settles the nerves a wee bit more. So Red Sox now have to play from behind. This is the only team they've lost to all tournament. Let's see how they come back as this falls now for Holder as he clears it away onto the halfway line, but no one up there for the fencibles. There's a touch there from Kurarangi. Comes near side here for Blackley. Good work here as Baker. Bit of room, but cleared away there by Matopi. That's better there from the Red Sox. Finding space in behind the defensive line. Just going to feel that temperature change here in Christchurch. Sun gets lower. That will be a throw in here. Good turn there and shoots, but just wide of the target there. It's a great turn there from Rose. As he just turns, tries to pivot and send that one towards the back post. Again, the facts given to me. Apparently, Ruben Rose has the most Instagram followers in the team. Nice little stat there, and I'm sure with finishes like that, it's not surprising. And here he is again now on the ball. Can't win that one. And it is Holder who will come away with it. But good work here from the Red Sox. As Whiteley is taken down. As Whitley dragged down by Holder. Dangerous position this for the Fencibles. There's the goalkeeper. Johnson sets up his wall. Bit of sun in his eyes as well. Here be a difficult. As the referee finds the mark. Not a lot of height advantage for either side. We rose here to deliver. Goes towards goal. Headed away there by Holder. As they almost get a bit caught up there. There's Rose again working hard, but has gone out for a goal kick. They will reset here. They're finding their way back into this one, though. Red Sox after that early goal. Toppy sends this one forward. A little touch there. Find space on the turn. Numbers out wide here for the Fencibles. Seem to be able to find that space as they come forward. And it's eventually turned over there. Chawanji 
Not towards that. And another foul there on Whitley. Sent this forward. It's forward here nicely. But it's Holder. He'll come away with it. He tries to send that one down the line, but he ends up on the south side. I think that was okay. Drag that one in. And again, apologies. No numbers on the Fencibles players. Far side now for number. Bit of space for him as he drives this one forward and a good run here. Still going though. Yeah, it's good defensive work in the end here, but it's fallen only as far at night. Drag of the shirt there, says the referee. Eight and a half minutes gone here in this first half. Under 14's final. Christchurch International Cup. Defensibles have the one 0 lead at the moment over the Red Sox. Tighter though since that first goal. Defensibles just at the moment able to find a little bit more space in midfield. There's a good little run forward here. And a heavy touch, but it's fallen again here for defensibles. Bit of space now out wide, drives down the line there, but good covering tackle there by Blackley. Corner ball I believe. Set piece opportunity here. It's not going to be hold up, it'll come forward. And no real target for either side. Yeah. Delivery's good. Yeah, good clearance away there. But it's still here with the defensive balls. A bit higher on defence in that situation to the Red Sox just to force them out. And eventually they do. Far side now. Tried to clear, but it will be sent out. By Chawanji. 15 minutes remaining in this first half. Just one real opportunity, which has been taken expertly. Switch play here from the Pensibles. Just give it too heavy there. Will be roll out now for a goal kick. Sing. Chips far side for number. As he drives this one forward. But it's fallen again here for the fencibles. Just first to the ball at the moment. And a good run forward here, but actually a heavy touch. As Kudarangi sees that one out of field. this out from the back Red Sox but it's just this part here that they're struggling with and this is a good ball forward here as Baker in a bit of space one on one with Matopi as he tries to link forward there with Barnett just rolls through to the keeper <coughs> and a good little step over there as Defensibles come forward with it. Red Sox clear their line, but this is fallen now for Baker. Bit of space for him. And a great challenge there from Holder. Had to be made. 
This is nice work here from the Fencibles. Just finding space at the moment. Ah, it's a pass it lets him down. Captain Rose. Chip forward now by Pearson. Uh, just caught offside there. Forward here from the Fencibles. Numbers forward, sent forward here. It's wrong out of field. Last pass at the moment. Just not quite landing either side, really. Good build up play. It's just that final attack in third. At the moment. It's this one clear down as far as halfway. To see the way that players are slightly bunched up in this area here, I'd like to see them just find a bit more space on, on the field. You can see the way that you look up to your top part of your screen. Plenty of space out there. We're only using half the field at the moment. Now they try to look to switch that, but it's Singh who's there. Drops us off for Matopi and a good move from him as Rose comes forward on him but still going as Matopi. And he sends this one away but it's the Red Sox who'll come away with it. Bit of room now as he steps inside, still going forward now. This is a good run. Centers chance. Oh, and just wide of the target there. Great opportunity. I think Johnson would have had that covered at the front post, but it's the first real opportunity for the Red Sox in this half. Bit of life now in this game. You see that sun getting lower and lower here as Holder sends this one away. It's Kate, you can't bring that under control. There's Blackley. Sent forward again from Pearson. And a chance. Oh, what a challenge. Still going though. And just can't hit the target. They're saying a touch on the way through. There is the referee. Moriyama creating the opportunity. Just couldn't get the shot on target there. It was a great first up challenge, but that second one. Got to hit the target from that range, but deflection was taken. So another set piece opportunity here. Delivered front post for Holder. He just sends that one away on the volley. Chance on the counter here is a good challenge there from Blackley. And Rose is away again. Holder comes forward on him. Still going as Rose. Needs some support. Somehow finds the feet of Pearson. Turning, still going as Pearson flashes across the face of the goal as Johnson comes across that one. Now the Red Sox finding some form now. Nine minutes remaining in this first half. Bit of a momentum shift in the favour of the side from Palmy. A little touch on the way through there. It will be a throw in for the Red Sox. Moriyama can't find a way past. Is that number on the far side? I think it looks like Singh's found his way out there. Yeah, 
Holder. Sink back for Holder. And that's a bad clearance. And a handball called there by the referee. Unlucky. And delivered forward again here by Holder. Falls here for the Red Sox. It's Pearson coming forward. Has numbers. Still going as Pearson. Can't deliver though. Falls here for Rose. Bit of space for him, but a good challenge there by Chong, I think it was, and he drives forward towards the halfway line. Still going. Yes, Whitley couldn't get the ball there. Sent forward. Blocked there again from Chiwanji. End to end at the moment. Think you ought to move that ball nicely through midfield. Can they deliver here? It's come across. Chance. And a great save. It is a save. As we wait to see what the decision is, will be a corner ball, but good save there from Castillo. We really look to parry that one over the bar, but somehow just fell towards the front post. Another big save. Little opportunity now for the Fencibles. They go short. Chipped in here. Again, and it just flashed across. And Sky there, what a golden opportunity to make it to. Just that spinning ball fell nicely. And in the end, the goal kick, so the Red Sox survive. And they'll come away down this near side for Baker as he drives down, but the toppy gets there first, falls back now for Holder. And it will be a throw in on this near side for the Red Sox. Blackley. Finds the feet of Rose, but just falls away from him. And the fencer balls will come forward with it now. It's good work on the counter, but again. Still going. Can they find space now? As it's out, far side for Moriyama. see a substitution here five minutes remaining in the first half unfortunately as I mentioned can't give you names there's no numbers on the players from the fence walls so apologies to those watching As the fence balls now looking to see what those substitutions inject into this game. It's fallen here for Rose as he drives into the half. Still going as Rose. Far side now for Moriyama as he cuts inside, but it's cleared away. Looks like that'll be a corner though. Set piece opportunity now for Red Sox. There's more substitutions coming. There's Goga, number seven, onto the field. He offers a bit of height there as they try to deliver it to him, but it's, again, it's that man holder who's getting in the way for the Red Sox. It's a nice delivered ball forward there, but again, falls nicely. There's Blackley, far side now for Baker as he cuts inside. Bit of space for him now. Rose. Pearson, good movement now from the Red Sox back as far as Kudurangi. Motoyama, he steps over there, still going, but pulled down, says the referee. 
Be a free kick on the far side. Just under three minutes remaining in this first half. 1-0 in favour of the Fencibles. So it will be Rose to deliver. As it falls as Singh can't connect with it. Still there, bouncing around. Cleared away now. Chance for the Fencibles to come away with it on the counter. Again, a good challenge from Rose, but just slows play down. And they do have numbers back now. It's a great ball forward, though, but Kurarangi, he's first there. If he sends that one away, we'll the touch on the way through there. As we do see the sun disappearing here in Christchurch. It's get quite chilly on the side. As the Fencibles look to launch it one more time, but a great challenge here. But can't connect. Does fall here for Blackley as he sends us forward towards Baker. Bit of time on the ball. Numbers coming back as that falls to Rose with a bit of deflection. Good ball forward here. Chance for Goga. But it's Johnson who comes forward. Just slows that play down. So he goes short to his captain. That's well kept in. Well set forward here. Press coming now from the fencibles. Uh, Simmons. Let's get that away, but it's another chance here for the fencibles inside the last minute. As Pearson sends that forward to Singh. It's Goga who gets there first. Now it's Morirama on the far side. As he tries to trick around, does well. A little touch will be a throw in. Not sure if there'll be added time here. So, last chance really in this first half. Found their way back into it, the Red Sox. It's a great start. Goal inside. First two minutes. Pearson. Bit of time for him. He gets the shot away. As a shot comes in. Still here, chance. As Baker just can't connect with it. And that'll do it for the first half. We'll go into the break at 1 0 in the favour of the Fencibles. Goal scored inside. The first two minutes. We have a short break here. And we'll be back for the second half. Don't go anywhere.
live here at the United Sports Centre. It's under 14's final of the Christchurch International Cup. It's the Fencibles. 1 0 over the Red Sox at the moment. It's been an entertaining first half, that's for sure. The Fencibles opening the scoring inside the first two minutes. And then the Red Sox really found their way back into the game. A couple of good opportunities. As well, four defensibles. Just one golden opportunity sent over the crossbar. 25 minutes remaining here. Still anyone's game. That sun almost gone. The referees doing their final checks. Seem ready to go. And the whistle is blowing, and it will be the Red Sox to get us underway as they just push that one forward and hold or let that one roll through to his keeper. It's like the way the defensibles were able to work it out from the defensive line in that first half. Just that final third inhibited them from adding to that wonderful first goal. It's a great little chip. As Fencibles still hungry for possession. At the start of the second half. Just a reminder for those watching at home, this is under 14s. Quality on display here. Fantastic. As the Fencibles still trying to find that way through for that second goal. There's quite a bit of space out here at the turfs. As Singh just chips this one forward. As Motoyama taken down there as Singh tries to send that one forward but runs out of real estate. <laughs> as Chenmaji gets us back underway. Pearson drops for Simmons. Good challenge coming forward here. Bit of space for the fencibles on the attack. No numbers forward though. That's headed away by Pearson. Still falls here for the Fencibles. Just need to get some numbers in the box. And a foul, says the referee. So a set-piece opportunity here for the Fencibles. It was Kate who was taken down. And it will be Holder. He'll step forward to take this one. His delivery is good, but a little touch on the way through there. It was Blackley. There will be a corner. As they go short. Still numbers forward here as they cut inside, chip this one in. Chance to head. And it's saved there by the keeper, but still life here. And hit it off the line. And Rose finally gets that one away. Goodness gracious me. Big opportunity there for the Fencibles and the Red Sox hanging on. Well, a few opportunities there. And no one could just put it in the back of the net. There's delivery again, but headed away this time by the Red Sox. It does fall down. Bit of a chance on the counter here. They've got numbers. Moriyama on this near side. There's Singh. Sleeves that one through there for his keeper. Good. Countering opportunity there for the Red Sox. Goga as Holder. 
Comes near side. Sent forward here. And well put out there by Kudurangi. He's played well, the number four. Every time he's been called on, he's been equal to it. There's the Fencibles trying to find a way to double their lead. Fallen here, midfield for the Fencibles. Use that space on the far side. Good ball forward here. Tries to turn around. Kudurangi again, who's there. Rose launches this one forth. It's a good ball forward here for Moriyama. Bit of space for him. Sing on him. Steps forward. Still going. Delivers. Holder gets a foot to that one. Can he clear a weight? No. Still there, but Singh clears us away. Down as far as Chiwanji. Morirama still going. Bit of space. Can he get the ball in the middle? Falls for Singh. And the Fencibles. Oh, they'll clear their lines now. Coming forward. Numbers back again, though, for the Red Sox. They've tracked back well on defence moment no numbers forward and it's great defensive work there from Chiwanji five minutes gone in this first half as we see a change it's Blackley coming to the site it's replacement shortly yeah, Singh will get us back underway Great turn there as he drives forward. Can't get around that man. Kudurangi. As they send this forward, Holder steps forward. Rose, two captains come together. And it's Rose who comes away with it. Falls nicely here and a good turn here by Goga. Go, Sora! Go, Sora! It's going to fall here for Singh. Bit of time for him as he just chips this one forward. Yes, but it's Rose who's there first. Still going as Rose. Taken down. No, says the referee as it's delivered into the middle. Chance! Shot! Just wide of the target. Swiftly. Can't get his head over that one. Positive signs though for the Red Sox. Chances at both ends in this half. Six and a half minutes gone in the second half. 1-0 in favour of the Fencibles. There's this one. It's down towards the halfway line. I don't think it's anyone's game at the moment. It's just time. All the Red Sox at the moment. Got to get one goal. That's a good turn there. Still going. Uh, the Fencibles. A great touch again. And offside, says the referee. Well spotted there from the assistant on the far side. As the Red Sox launch this one forward. There's Goga. Heads that one forward, but it'll be Johnson. He'll collect it. Good pressure. Good pressure. He just chips this one forward. And it's found its way down to the halfway line. Yeah, that's a great ball down the line there. Moriyama. Still going as Moriyama drops for his captain Rose. Looks to push that one far side, but a good head there from Offensibles defence tracking back. Keep pressing! Yes, Matopi. It's managed to get that one away as they clear their lines. Yes, Kudurangi. Again, in the right position there. Simmons drops back for his goalkeeper, Castello. Whitley. 
Almost puts his teammate under pressure there, but still in possession are the Red Sox. Patient build up here. As they look to launch now, this has fallen. Got a heavy touch, but Rose is there. Drops this one back near side now for Chowanji. Cuts back inside. Pearson. Threads this one through, but Johnson will come forward and collect that. Creating more opportunities now are ah, the Red Sox. Offensibles are they holding on at the moment. Whitley. Advantage called by the referee there. There's Baker. Can't keep that one. And the Fencibles will come away with it now. Bit of a chance here, but falls for Simmons. There's Kidd. Was the substitution mate, number two on the far side. This is good from the Red Sox. Tatis Curse. There's the Fencibles. They seem to look to hold possession. There's a chance here for Goga and a bit of space. Holder still going as Goga. And Moriyama on the snare side, but chose not to use him. And the Fencibles will come away with it. Except for them, they've got to almost force the Red Sox to come for it. Just holding on to possession for that little bit longer. Need to do anything silly. There's falls there for Baker and a foul says the referee. Just on halfway line. As we took over ten and a half minutes gone here. There's substitutions coming now for the fencer balls. to go long. It's holders there first. There's defensibles. Good move forward here, but just that touch there. Still here for the defensibles as they drive forward again. As well kept in, still going. Centers chance. Can they get the shot away? Dancing around. Just quite falling there for the opportunity there's the fencibles baker on the far side it's been a good battle between those two it's hoppy and taikawa baker the Red Sox, which another attack, but cleared away there by the Fencibles. Come on, Red Sox! Yeah, we just had a couple of half chances. On either side. Able to find a way through at the moment as the captain rose. A chance for the shot, it's a great shot, and carried away by Johnson. A great shot that one. There's the keeper. Couldn't calm it. Skudurangi. Pearson. Simmons, far side now for Kid. Rose, hands in the back, says the referee. Oh, great ball forward there for Barker. Good touch as well. Drops for Rose. Gets it onto his right. Still going as Rose. Lays it off here. Cleared away there by the Fencibles. They survive again as they put the press forward here. Yes. Yeah, good work, Lockie. Good work, Lockie. Whitley who comes away with it. This pass can't find Barker. Again, it's just not committing numbers forward. 
are the Fencibles. Happy to sit back. See here. Slowly, they get their numbers across the halfway line. It's well held up there. There's will be a throw in on the far side. It's not committing numbers forward at the moment. Are the Fencibles. You can see the way the Red Sox are set up. Three forward, chasing that game. It's offside on the far side. Eleven minutes remaining in this second half, under 14's final, the Christchurch International Cup. It's the Fencibles leading over the Red Sox, Manawa two. One goal to nil. That goal coming inside the first two minutes of the game. Been scoreless since. Not through lack of opportunities for both sides. There's the Fencibles. Slip to control this one. You can see real numbers committed for the Red Sox. Back in numbers and chance to shoot. He gets the shot away. And it's in! Ah! Oh, what a finish! Drives that one low and hard towards the left. And the keeper, diving to his right, couldn't save that one as they head off to the corner to celebrate and the referee says no thanks. Well, 10 minutes remaining here. Fencibles, two goals to the good. First goal in the first half. Came to life a little bit more, did the Red Sox. Let's see if that brings this team as Rose. No, sends this no, one forward. No, no. There's Johnson. Yeah, to be aware there. You can see there a little bit of a change. It's like Hirurangi. Still sit a little bit higher on the field. We're back with the fencibles here coming forward. And that will be a corner. It's falling here now for the Fencibles. Nine minutes remaining. Sun is almost set here in Christchurch. Great three days. This tournament. Big game tomorrow as well, Sydney FC. Taking on Christchurch United under 15s as we go now to the corner. It's Holder who delivers near post. Falls here. Can they get the shot away? And they'll just recycle this one. Will the Fencibles. Two goals to the good. Just need possession. Football. This is going to run down the line. Centering. And it's cleared away again by the Red Sox. That's the Fencibles who are there first. Is dancing around, trying to find a way through. Chance to shoot here. Tries to drop it back inside, but it's a good challenge by Rose, who comes charging forward now as he sends this one away for Barker. Numbers forward now for the Red Sox. Can they link up? Goga turns around. Holder down the line for Barker, but offside, says the referee. They had the overlap. And the Fencibles, will they survive? Seven and a half minutes remaining. Can the Red Sox get a goal back to make this final a little bit tighter? Is a good ball forward here. And there's good tracking back there by Pearson, who just sends it out wide. Good pace there, Sean, by the number six. Still with the Fencibles, though, on the far side. Just need to hold it here. Do the Fencibles. That breaks down, and forward come the Red Sox. That turned over again. Both sides at the moment. Trying to run it forward as Rose launches this one forward. 
Go, Soren! Go, Soren! There he goes. He's had a great game of defence, takes a shot, saved, falls there, but no one following up again for the Red Sox. But a great opportunity. Fidurangi creating the opportunity and a good save by Johnson. Go, Soren! And as he's still going here, is the number four. Drops us off a rose. The shot comes in, a good head away there from Holder, I think it was. Go, Dylan! Wow. Six minutes remaining. End to end at the moment as the fencibles come away with it on the halfway line. Good work, Lockie. Good work, Lockie. Just a couple of numbers forward as they hold it up. You can see the midfield eventually arriving for the fencibles. They do hold it up well there. There's a foul, says the referee. Pearson called for it and a good shooting opportunity now for the fencibles. Will be the captain holder, I think. We'll step forward on this one. The position from where I am. This will be the nail in the coffin for the Red Sox. As Holder drops near side. Can they get the centering ball? Do. And it's saved off the line. Still falls here for Holder as he drives, but blocked away again. Still here for the Fencibles as it's Holder again. Shapes to shoot, but gets around and caught again there by Rose. So another free kick just a couple of metres to the right. As the lights start to come on here at the United Football Centre. We've got Holder here in good position. Four and a half minutes remaining. Holder goes for goal this time. And it's just wide of the target. Well left there by Costello. And they take it quickly to the Red Sox. Again, it's turned over. And it will be another foul. Trying to get that ball back are the Red Sox. Four minutes remaining. There's the Fencibles to send this one in. Only as far as the front. Oh, it's the wall created there by the Red Sox. And a good turn here from the Fencibles. Delivery, heavy touch, but a bicycle. Just wide of the target, but it's picked up by the teammate. And they'll step forward again. Good step over there. As Holder just launches this one down. And that'll be a goal kick. So, final three minutes here. And substitutions made by the Red Sox. Inject something for these final few. The Fencibles just got to hold on now. Press coming. They still want more though. As this one falls in midfield. Can't get that pass right, but no harm done. That's yeah, a good little move there. Uh, expertly done by Chuanji, but still falls here for the Fencibles. As they chip that one forward. Is that still in? Not sure, but the shot comes away. And it's off the side of the boot. Does end up on the far side. Defensibles still trying to get another one. And it's a foul. He's just on the edge of the area. There's time. Ticking away now for the Red Sox. Substitutions coming from the Fencibles. Let's see Captain Holder. Giving his marching orders back to halfway for this one. There's, you see some substitutions being made here. 
there for time. Just takes away again. A minute and a half remaining on the game clock as the shot comes in here. Straight to the keeper though, good hands. And they'll launch it one more time here, will the Red Sox. Goga can't get a touch on that. There's Holder, this clears that one away. This we see Easton onto the field. the fencibles now just need to see this one out for the final minute what can the Red Sox do all just falling now all the players in blue yeah, as a shot comes in but collected nicely there by the keeper and a chance to launch forward as they do touch there from Whitley Can't find their way out. There's the fencibles. That's finding some good angles here on the passes. As we tick away into the final 10 seconds on the game clock, the fencibles. Well, they'll take out this year's under 14 competition. Commendable effort from the Red Sox, 13th last year, to make it to the final this year. It's been a fantastic turnaround. I'm sure the coaches and parents are extremely proud of what the players have achieved. And that'll do it here for the Christchurch International Cup under 14s. It is the Fencibles from Auckland who take this one two goals to nil over the Red Sox from Palmerston North. It's been an absolute honour to call you through this one. Plenty more action over the next few days. If you are in the area, do come around. Until then, stay safe.